treasure seekers and fortune finders and welcome back to another adventure from coins collectibles and pay dirt yeah that's right i'm thinking about changing the name but a little more on that later so what are we doing today we are digging into some golden goodness oh well i said we were so what have we got we know we got a bag of pay dirt but this is something special. This is not only a bag of pay dirt, but a 100% return on investment bag of pay dirt. More than likely. Let's kindly open this up without trying to clip it. Oh yeah, we did good. So guys, let's just set this here for right now. Y'all want to see what it is? Is the suspense really getting you that bad? Okay. I guess I can show you. So what we have here today is a sandwich. Is it a sandwich? No, it's not a sandwich. It is J&J &J Prospecting, also known as Alaskan Nugget 907 on eBay. I believe it's 907. But this is some amazing pay dirt. This is generally all super fine gold. One gram of gold added to one half pound of concentrate. Now, guys, this is some extremely, extremely tough stuff to pan. It will take a little while to pan all this. Generally, this has an amazing return. Amazing. Now, I give $80 for a half pound, but this is his super concentrate. I've seen 1.23 to 1.6 plus grams come out of this. So, a lot of this is how well you can pan. Really, this is some awful panning stuff, but I love it. One of my favorite pay darts. I love the fine gold, the challenging. It's really nice to hone your skills with. It's great for testing equipment, and it's one of my favorite pay darts. Uh, I love all the fine gold pay darts. If I don't knock my camera over. So guys, we know what we're into right now. And I will try to get a way to get in touch with him. Uh, I'm on his Facebook group. He just popped up a few bags. Hopefully, you'll have some up before long, maybe on eBay. If he does, I'll give you the link there. If not, if he's interested, I'll just give you the link to the Facebook group. Y'all can keep a check on it for when he has bags. Enough with it. Let's just get to some pay dirt. But first... Let's open this baby up. And this is going to be full of black sands, guys. I'm almost certain it is. This is a 100% authentic unsearched concentrate with one gram added from Alaska. You're not going to get more authentic than what this is. And I am so glad he double bagged that. Oh, oh, oh. So we didn't lose none, that's great. Just to show you what I'm talking about with the black sands, let's get all this out because, hey, that could have a lot of gold in it, That just that little bit, guys. I know I sound crazy, but it really could. If you've never seen this pay dirt, you'll know exactly what I'm talking about here in a minute. So let's just check it for some magnetite. Watch. That definitely makes this for some difficult panning. If you're a new, new to panning, this stuff is always, always best to separate the black sands. When you're separating the black sands, don't just take a magnet, go over it and think you've got it separated. Because not only did you separate black sands, you also lost gold. Have you a whole line set up with water in it? Dump it in, take the black sands out, move it to the next tray. Take the black sands out, move it to the next one. It'll really keep you from losing a lot of gold. This isn't just you can pull the black sands and think you're done with it. You'll still have gold in it. But that's enough of that. Let's get to panning. We'll be back here soon. I 
All right, y'all ready to pan? And I'm gonna show everybody just how tough this stuff can be. I'm gonna take two soup spoons. Two soup spoons, and just watch the amount of gold that'll be in these two soup spoons. One. Two. Not much, huh? Wait till y'all see this. You're going to love this. Here we go. And this isn't one that you're going to want to dump and run. Slightly dirty. Got slight organics to it. And we will definitely, definitely be careful with this stuff. No gold showing yet, huh? And like I said, this won't have a load of flakes. I have seen some of his stuff here lately that is having some flakes in it. Hmm. You got a little rock in there. Oh, no. Look here. Guys, look at that. Two tablespoons. Two tablespoons. Or two soup spoons. Excuse me. This stuff you really have to be careful with. I'm debating whether I want to do high speed dirt today or not because it just, this stuff takes a long time. To really keep from losing any gold, it takes a long time. And I will be panning this three times minimum. And then I will definitely put this up and I'll use it later to run through some equipment and test some equipment. Thinking about getting me a bucket concentrator. I have got a red of all of my mining equipment. So thinking about getting just a little few pieces to help me run my concentrates after my accumulation at the end of the year. Nothing big. All right, we should be working down to that shiny. Let's just see what we got here. Hmm. Almost looks like a little wet lead weight, guys. Y'all see that coming through there? Look at that. Two soup spoons. And trust me, there's a lot of gold still down here, guys. Two soup spoons. Wow. Let me get that back around here. Get out of there. So now y'all kindly see what I'm talking about. This stuff definitely isn't a dump and run. There's no way I could not and worry about losing a lot of gold. So there you go, two spoons. Let me get off here and I'm probably gonna work some down for you and so I'm gonna leave it in. And when we come back, we will do a high speed dirt. Please be considerate. You're going to have a lot of time of painting on this. So I'm going to do the best I can with you. I might speed up the video a little more, but this is not something that I want to lose a lot of gold in. So we will see you back here soon.
All right, guys, what an adventure that was, and what a bag of dirt. Always amazing, always tough, always a challenge, but always fun. So, what did we get? We got some AU. No, but in all seriousness, are y'all ready to weigh this up? The hardest part about this gold is not pinning it from the dirt, but getting it out of the snuffer bottle. But enough with that, let's see what we roll. Got some chunkies in there. Look at this, guys. Oh, look at that. Nope, we got more. Keep it coming. There we go. There we go. I don't think we're going to get any more. Nope, it don't look like it. There's still some fines in here. There we go, guys. Look at that. This is a half pound super concentrate with one gram added. What did we get out of a half pound of dirt? 0.42 grams. Guys, amazing. That's why I love this seller. Now, I don't know when he'll have any up on eBay. This is J and J Prospecting. On eBay, he's Alaskan Nugget 907. I will contact him before I post this video and ask for permission to put the Facebook link up. If not, I'll try to get a link for everybody to get a hold of him. This is some amazing stuff. If you can paint it. This is not a run and done dirt. I have worked on this for a little over two hours panning and repainting and repainting and repainting trying to get every speck of gold I could. And guess what? I didn't succeed. There'll always be fine gold that mix in with the black. Now, I was pretty happy with the cleanness of the dirt. I really was meticulous with this, so that's pretty true weight right there. I might lose a little bit, but 1.42 grams. So what was the return on investment on this? 100%. I've really never had any of his dirt that hasn't reached 100%. Now, I did give $80 with shipping on this, and we recovered our money back. <sighs> what a fun bag of pay dirt, guys. So, if you haven't tried this yet, and you are up for the challenge, definitely give this one a try. It is absolutely amazing. If you can paint it, you won't be disappointed. You might have a headache and be frustrated, but you won't be disappointed. So with that, guys, I'm going to shut this down. Until next time, may your pans be full, your smiles be golden, your clouds be silver lined, and your cards be secret rare. We'll see you on the next adventure, treasure seekers.